spot in the northern scum may be on their way out of the Maryland state song. The state Senate has passed a bill eliminating most of the lyrics in Maryland, my Maryland. WJZ is live. Pat Warren has more on these proposed changes. Hi, Pat. Hi, Jess. You may hardly, if ever, hear them sing the lyrics to Maryland, my Maryland, but they come from a poem that calls the state to the Confederacy, and they're sung to the tune of Oh, Christmas Tree. The despot's heel is on thy shore. The despot's heel may be getting the boot. Living here my whole life like a lot of Marylanders, and I've hardly talked to anybody that's ever read the whole poem and knew what was in it. Avenge the patriotic gore that flecked the streets of Baltimore. A portrait of the author, James Ryder Randall, hangs in the office of Senate President Mike Miller, along with a note Randall wrote in 1893. I'm a historian. I love to keep history intact. I want to keep all our statues intact, but words can be harmful. She is not dead, nor deaf, nor dumb. Huzzah, she spurns the northern scum. Under the bill, the General Assembly relegates the current lyrics to the status of historic state song, with the most inoffensive lines remaining as the official state song. But I can recognize why the change is necessary, and uh, we keep the best part of the song. Uh, remembering Howard, remembering uh, Carol, and at the same time, we had a stanza talking about the beauty of Maryland. Dear mother burst the tyrant's chain. There have been years of discussion about changing the song, but Senate bill sponsor Ron Young hopes this latest approach turns the corner. We think it's a much more positive, forward-looking uh, song now. Maryland, my Maryland. Now, there had also been some talk about holding a contest to come up with an entirely new and different song, but the Senate thought better of that. I'm Pat Warren reporting live. Now back to you, Jess. All right, Pat, thank you. The bill sponsor in the House is Delegate Karen Young, the Senate sponsor's wife.